So, how much more vocal do you feel like you can be on this team? Uh, I mean, uh, we had some leaders graduate last year, uh, transfer out of here. So, uh, we had Peyton coming back. He was really low, vocal last year. But, I mean, I got, got to kind of be vocal as a freshman, which a lot of people don't get to do. Uh, in my meetings at the end of the year, the coaches kind of told me that a lot of leadership roles were kind of opening up. And if you're going to be a point guard, you got to be vocal. And I kind of always been that. I always kind of had that in my game. So, I really got to kind of improve on that this year, kind of take it more uh, take it more on as a head leader. And it's been really good so far. Well, that's kind of your natural way is to tell people what to do as a point guard. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of, comfortable. Always, kind of always what I've done, kind of how I've always played. It's uh, kind of what I take pride in and kind of being that on-court coach. And uh, the coaches have been great with kind of letting me do that, kind of do it how I do it. It's sometimes it's a little more tougher than they'd like it to be, but they kind of know that it's because I like to win games and I'm a competitive person and it kind of rubs off on the other guys on the team. So it's been good so far. Well, guys are comfortable with you making them uncomfortable sometimes? Uh, yeah, I think uh, as guys have been here, they kind of know that I work really hard and I kind of have always been, I'm tough on myself, so they kind of respect that if I'm tough on myself, I can kind of be tough on them. I know what I think, what, what it will take to win, and they know that that's the only reason I'm being hard on people. It's not because I don't like them, it's just because I want to win basketball games. You've never lacked for confidence or competitiveness, but how much more comfortable do you feel this year? For sure. I mean, the coaches have kind of been great with just working with me in the offseason, kind of telling me what they expect from me this year, uh, kind of just being able to kind of play with a lot of freedom, kind of do what I do as a point guard role, kind of be, do what I do as a leader, and it's just been awesome to see the freedom that they gave me and just that comfortability. How nice to be in, potentially being maybe a starter this year and out there with Owen, and you guys can you guys are kind of read each other's minds so well. Together. For sure, yeah. I mean, we've always kind of played really well together to be able to do that at a higher level with uh, more minutes together this year. It's going to be really fun to see, a lot of fun for a lot of pe other people to see as well. But the the common theme I've heard is that team shooting the heck out of the ball right now. Is that fair? For sure. I mean, yeah, in practices, I mean, kind of makes it tough on the defense. We kind of get mad at each other because guys are hitting shots, but they're not. A lot of them aren't easy shots. Just we got a lot of really good shooters, so it's been really fun to see just how well everybody's shooting the ball right now. How good can this team be? Uh, I think a lot of the a lot of people are excited, especially within our team, how much noise we can make this year, how many win, how many games we can win. We know what we have. We know what level we can compete at. A lot of other people don't know that, and that, I think that's what makes it even more exciting for the for the guys on the team. You have always drawn motivation from people telling you you can't do something. You're looking at some of these preseason expectations for this team: 11, 16. Mm -hmm. Do you draw? I I, I got to imagine you've got that pinned up in a wall somewhere. For sure. I mean, yeah, that's kind of always who I've been, kind of always what I've had to go through, what I've taken pride in, kind of proving people wrong. Now as a team, we kind of get to do that again this year. We did that last year and get to do it at a higher level this year. Kind of just been talking to the guys like, hey, this is fun. Like when people don't think you're going to be good and you get to prove everybody wrong, it's a great feeling. Just great to do as a team. What do some of these new guys bring to the table? Uh, I mean, yeah, the new guys have added a lot. Uh, the freshman class is really good. We got Cooper Koch. He's brought a, just a different level of competitiveness, competitiveness to this team, just kind of came in and just attacked dudes. It's been awesome to see Chris Tajo, super athletic, goes and gets every rebound he can. It's just been awesome to see his improvement even just throughout the summer and the fall. We got Seydu from Manhattan. I think he brings just a different level of basketball to our team. I mean, he grew up in the Bronx, so just brings that hard-nosed basketball, kind of attack you, kind of talk a little stuff too. Just awesome for this team. And then Drew, obviously, winning his player at Moorhead State, kind of aggressive guard, just kind of wins games and knows how to win games so it's been awesome to see good more important guy wants to talk to you now so 